Hey y'all. It's been a really long time. I know I'm so wrong right now. Late and wrong. But guess what? I'm sitting here with a whole lot of products and a little sip and some lip gloss for reapplication. We're about to get it on because I have so missed making videos. It's been really busy. It's been some changes in life. Good changes though. So let's just get it on. Let's just start it. Um, I've owed you guys this video for a really long time. I got this sample set for $5 like six months ago. Um, no, it wasn't that long ago, but it was probably a good like three months ago. Um, and I really, I've used it several times. Love it. And I couldn't wait to come tell you guys about it, but I just really didn't have time. So here I am. We are going to talk about, I love my fro. The cutest packaging ever. This one, please excuse it. Okay, it was under my sink and some things clearly happened. This one had some oil with it. I love that about natural products. Just rub it in. Rub it in. So we have, this was the Curly Kinky Coily Cream Gel. This is the Butter Whip. Shea Butter Whip in Mango. Y'all, I have to excuse me. I still don't know where to look on this camera. Like, should I look over here? I don't know. When I look at it, it looks like I'm looking away at any rate. Um, and this is the leave-in. I think it's black tea. Yeah, black tea leave-in. And this is the avocado oil. Okay, so I use these several times as my um, lock method. I absolutely love the black tea leave-in spray. Um... I know this is not going to do much for you guys, but it's light. You see it? Um, when you put it in your hair, like it, it just it has a very like faint smell of of tea, like a herbal tea. Um, but it smells good. And um, when I put it in my hair, I noticed that it just it would get softer. It stayed moisturized a little bit longer. Um, I really, really, really liked that. Um, I still use this consistently. Um, I, I spray that in. I'm gonna go straight to the avocado oil. I like this. I can't tell you like specifically what the huge difference was to any other kind of oil, but it was, it was, I like it. Like I like all these products. I use them together several times. I use them with other products several times and like them. Now this butter, I don't love, I know you guys, you might be able to see, see the oil is running in there. I don't love that aspect, but if you mix it, it, it does emulsify well, so it doesn't stay runny like that, but it smells good. To me, it smells more like cocoa butter than mango, but um, this was good. This was okay. Again, it wasn't like, I didn't have like a huge reaction for this. It, I mean, it just was another butter. Um, this cream gel is very liquidy. As you see, I just almost spilled it. Um, it's light. I kind of expected it to be um, like heavier because it's a gel, but I have to tell you the hold with it was pretty awesome. I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna guess and say there's flaxseed in here because the hold was great. I used this several times with twist outs. Nice definition. Um, no tackiness, no stickiness. I really I can feel it now, kind of shaking around in there. But again, it's very liquidy, so it's like. It's not hard to apply, but it's not like a typical gel. Um, so overall, I kind of get, I gotta give her like a B plus, A minus to start. Like, I would definitely buy more of her products. The packaging is so cute. I can't wait to see um, what other things she comes out with, and I will continue to use the sample set that I've received.